casing off overburden and in this episode we're going to discuss the same thing but we're going to do it using three rod strings and why we would do that. First off the three sizes of rod strings are all designed to fit within each other. The three that we use are NQ, HQ and PQ also known as HWT. In this diagram the driller is attempting to advance his casing to bedrock but he's meeting too much resistance within the overburden and his drill is being overpowered by it. He just doesn't have enough torque in his system to continue drilling and advancing that casing rod string to bedrock. So in this instance, we have NQ, which has made it all the way to bedrock, and HQ, which has made it down to this gravel seam that we have in this scenario, and he's unable to continue advancing. If he were to pull his rods out of the hole, the same thing would happen just like in the last episode where the hole caves in on itself and when he re-enters the hole, he could deviate and start a new hole. So before any of the rods come out of the hole, the driller must advance the HWT over the HQ and this will alleviate the resistance that it's causing on the drill system, the, the drill's torque, and he'll be able to continue advancing the HQ. And now you're able to pull your NQ out to change the bit and to continue drilling and control your cuttings. In our next episode, we're going to discuss the core barrel, the inner tube, and how we should be chasing our core barrel with our casing. Thank you.